What is up, bros and brides? I'm Ingslasher44, and this is probably one of the most important videos I've made since Black Ops 3 comes out. It has to do with the best, most overpowered, however you want to look about it, the best gun in Black Ops 3. And I really believe that this gun I'm about to talk to you guys about really is the best weapon. And I think it got a little bit nerfed, but I think it was just with aim down sights time. I'm not 100% sure on that, but it is still. I've used it since then. It is still a mother effed beast, and it's not what everyone says, it's not the VMP, it's not the M8A7, or, or um, the Shiva, which everyone is talking about, it's not that, it's none of those, it's an LMG, and that's really refreshing, because there really hasn't been any good LMGs since, like, Black Ops 2, Black Ops 2 had really good LMGs, and this one I'm about to talk to you about is called the Gorgon, this thing is absolutely unreal. This thing's claim to fame is that basically every time you get in a gunfight, you will kill the person you are shooting at in two bullets. And it's not no matter what, if there is any bullet penetration whatsoever, it'll go to more bullets, and it can go up to, like, five bullets with you, like, if you're shooting through, like, a thick wall. The bullet penetration on this gun is not good at all, and even with FMJ, it doesn't do much. I, trust me, I've tried it out. I figured out the best class for this, um, which I'm not going to talk too in-depth, because when I make a best class setup video for this gun, um, I will go into it then, but I will tell you what attachments you should use so, to, for it. So, with this gun, a lot of you may assume that since it's an LMG, you're not going to be able to move around as quick, and it shoots really slow, it's a bad gun. No, 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 no. It's a two-bullet kill anywhere on the map, and it is just unreal. Real. Now, that being said, you can't play with this gun like you would an SMG or anything like that. The way I play with this gun is I kind of stick to a loop around the outside of the map, and I keep a 15 meter distance between me and everyone. Now, that can't always happen. It's not always going to happen that you're that 15 meters away from someone, and this is where the magic really happens. Let's say you're not 15 meters away, and someone comes up and shoots you. If they get the first bullet on you, you're still fine. You can still win that gunfight because then all of a sudden you just turn, shoot them. This gun gives the other player so much recoil that they're then not shooting at you. And then you just put two bullets on them. One more bullet after that one you already put on them and they're dead. They're, they're dropped dead. The time to kill on this gun is so ridiculously fast. It's insane. Not to mention that with the class setup I'm giving you, you want to use a red dot sight, a grip, and rapid fire the rapid fire is where the magic really happens so as far as these attachments goes the reason why i use red dot sight is because this gun does shoot really slow which means you need to be on target any gun in the game where that shoots slow whether it's the shiva whether it's the gorgon whatever it is you need to be on target because as soon as you're on target that is when you're going to drop the person very very quickly with this gun so that's why i use a red dot sight it's not needed but i just find it helpful if you're not using a red dot sight i would highly highly recommend using something like a quick draw grip because getting on target incredibly important with this gun so then after that grip why do i use grip because at a distance this thing does have a good amount of recoil but when you can control it and it's definitely definitely controllable once you have grip on it's actually like a laser beam once you have grip on um it's definitely handleable and that's why i use grip and then finally the rapid fire is where the magic happens so this thing has a slow rate of fire very slow rate of fire it's kind of like thump 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 I know that that wasn't an even rate whatsoever, but once you have that rapid fire on, it's more like thump, 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 thump. It's a lot quicker, a lot quicker. And as soon as I put this attachment on, I was dropping people like there was no tomorrow. They were just dropping like flies. It was insane. And once you have this class set up, yes, it takes a while to get simply because the rapid fire is the last attachment you unlock. But once you have it, you are a killing machine. So with this gun, stick to longer engagements. Not not You don't have to be like really far away from them, but try to avoid being up close because a VMP will beat you in a gunfight right up close unless you get a bullet on them and they get thrown off because the amount of recoil that you give them. But overall, I literally think this thing as of now is the best weapon in the game. Whether it's going to be used in esports or not, I don't know, simply because um, you move a little bit slower with it. That's like the one drawback is you move a little bit slower, but for an LMG, you still move pretty damn quick. So overall, I think this is the best and most overpowered weapon in the game right now, and you should definitely give it a try out. Let me know how you do with it in the comment section below. Let me know what your favorite weapon is right now. I'm really interested to know those things, and uh, subscribe if you're new to the channel. I constantly am putting out new Black Ops content and subscribing is the way to become most informed and check me out on twitter if you have any need or want to get in contact with me twitter is the place to do so link in the description thanks for watching guys and until next time peace out